sorry. What the fuck was that? Sorry. No, I don't want sorry. They knew so much. You think that's bad? That is just a fraction of the questioning you'll get if this trial goes to court. Please, find somebody else. <laughs> there is nobody else, Stacey. If there were, do you think I'd be asking you? You're weak and you're soft and people can smell it a mile off. And I might be stupid enough to feel sorry for you, but Jory won't. I can't. You're going to go back in there, you're going to have a glass of water and you're going to pull yourself together. I'm not doing it. Excuse me? I quit. You quit? This isn't a poxy job in a stripper bar anymore, Stacey. This is where the big boys play. And like it or not, you've already started the game. And rule number one is that you don't quit. You either win or you lose. And I am not losing. You lied to me. What? You lied. You told them about Pete. You said you'd never tell anyone. Wake up, Stacey. Harris will know all about Pete. If you can't make it through a few questions about him without blubbering like a baby, then he's going to make mince meat out of you. This isn't about me. This is about you. You don't want to help me. You just want to score points with that prick. Well, I'm not helping anymore. I'm done. <laughs> you're done when I say you're done. Don't forget, Stacey, it's because of me that you're not currently locked in a prison cell. I am on your side. It doesn't feel like it. Well, you don't want to know what it feels like for me not to be on your side. I'll go to prison. I don't care. Prisoner, but at least he worries love. <laughs>